Yo, it's Retro Gaming Rat again with uh, a new random video game pickup videos. Okay, first of all, the Sega Genesis version of Paperboy 2. Yup, time to throw newspaper! The seller forgotten to add into the package during my last purchase, so he just sent. Last week, wow, it's, it's quite fast, yeah. I just received it this morning. Kudos to the seller. Second, for only $46, I got the Sega Satan Magic Knight Ray Earth. Yes, finally. I've been dying to get this since 10 over years back. It's so difficult to obtain this in Singapore. Even overseas, I heard there's only 15,000 copies being produced. I don't know the exact facts, I don't really care. But come on, the box art. Wow. <laughs> okay, now I just came back from a so called those old school game shop. Yeah, and bought some junks back. Remember during my last video, uh, yeah, I got a so-called micro genius set, but without any adapter or controller. Yeah, I managed to find some controller. I will show it to you. No. Okay, first of all, I got uh, myself a so-called a sealed copy of the Fantasy Star collection for the Game Boy Advance. Awesome collection. Oh, but only have part 1, part 2, and part 3. Funny, where's part 4? I don't know. <laughs> Second. Seriously, except for the word Steel Dome, I don't know what the hell is this game. I got it because, first of all, the box look cool and it's big anyway. It's only for, well, $5. So why not? <laughs> also, brand new seal. Third. Buxley 2 Is it how we pronounce it? I know it's a crap performer but as a Sega Genesis collector it is something that I can't you know let go yeah also brand new silk and I don't think I'll be playing it anyway yeah a lot of people think it's a piece of shit <laughs> next uh, so called newer game yeah it's a GameCube version of the Evolution Wars I believe it, it looked like the Dreamcast role playing game, but is it? I have no idea. Also, brand new seal. Yeah, all this game normally I bought it for less than $10. Yeah. Next, it's a Sega Genesis version of Jordan vs. Bird. My favorite basketball player, Michael Jordan. Okay, although it's it's not really new, yeah, it's an open copy, wow, then look at the spine, it's like being red, but it's only for two dollars, why not, I believe it's completed, in, yep, uh, how come the cartridge is open, upside down, yeah, I come with the menu and the cartridge, well, it's two dollars, next, a sealed copy of World Trophy Soccer, come on, sports game, I believe a lot of people do not wish to collect them, but as long as it doesn't have a year, why not? I don't think it has any license player anyway. Okay, it's a brand new seal coffee. Okay. I don't really care much about seal coffee, but uh, you know lah. If since I'm not going to play it, if got a seal one is better. I don't think it's worth a lot of money anyway. Next is a Japanese edition of the kickboxer. Kickboxing, sorry. It's made by Micro World. I think it made the game Slime World or something like this. I don't know. It look crap. Uh. Anyway. Also, same thing. It comes with a uh, well. Cartridge. And menu. Very important for those who collect games. Next. Aha. Uh. Uh -huh. A bunch of Micro Genius controller. Yep. Two dollars each. Well, with turbo buttons. Finally, I can give the Michael Genius a test 
or a run because without the controller, I cannot do anything. I do not own any Nintendo or Famicom. I own a few Famicoms and Nintendo games, but I use the so-called the Retron Nintendo adapter to play them. So, uh, if I'm free, maybe I, f I s uh, make a video video review about the IQ501, the Micro Genius set next week. Yep. Stay tuned. <laughs> Free controller, each for two. Uh, I forget the price. I know it's very cheap. I think less than ten bucks. Okay. Next, the Sega Saturn version of Battle Arena Toshiden Remix. Uh, I don't know where. The, okay, the cover is cracked. It's supposed to be sealed, but I think it's crushed. I don't really care anyway. Okay. Toshiden is one of my favorite games. Okay, next, the Sega CD version, Mortal Kombat! Yeah, the so-called perfect edition, is it the perfect edition? I don't know. Some say actually it doesn't really vary much. Well, I see the price tag, $39.90 last time. I got it for $5. Well, it look factory still, roll ready, but it look badly rigged also. <laughs> okay, yeah, I believe this is my last one. Eh, not the last. So yeah, this is my final one. It's the game that I always wanted to get. The Sega version of Internal Champions. Double the fighter, double the amount of fighters, and one health. It got a nice cinem cinematic kill or something like this. I know it's not really a great fighting game, but as a Sega fan, this is a must own. Made by Deep Water. Okay, that's all, folks. And thanks for watching. See you. Bye bye.